uh, my son's point of view, he came back from school with his science uh, test. It had uh, the story about a moth. The moth crawls out from the cocoon, dries its wings so that it can fly. So the, why it struggles out from the cocoon is to dry its wings. And the question was, why does a moth struggle out from a cocoon? And you know, his answer was, in life, there are many struggles. <laughs> if you can deal with one, it helps you deal with more that comes along, right? If you so, met my father, you know what my struggles are. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> so, you know, obviously he's marked wrong because that's not the answer. The answer is, the moth struggles out to dry its wings. Then when he comes home, the role is then our responsibility as parents. Do you outsource the parenting to the teacher or do you come back and you tell him, that's not what the teacher wants, but that's really proud of you. That's the correct answer. What toy do you want to buy because I'll buy you the biggest one? You know, and that builds self-confidence and, and all the values that you want them to have. On parallel to that, uh, I just scale down to a simple story. My mum was at the coffee shop ordering a fruit juice, right? So there was apple juice orange juice, watermelon. So she told the shopkeeper, I want apple orange. And the shopkeeper was stunned. No, 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 no. Apple or orange? Only one, because that's what the menu says. And she's like, no, no, no. You just do a bit of apple, a bit of orange, and then you mix them into one cup. No, no, you can only buy apple or buy orange. So she, she bought both. She had to buy both and mix it in front of the shop, shopkeeper's face. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha